um, welcome to another episode of uh, MrLopezClasset.com. You remember this is the Leopard 44, the boat of Oyoli and uh, Mr. Steve, uh, the owner of this uh, wonderful boat. Uh, we are repairing both uh, engines, uh, the starboard engine and the port engine. You remember some weeks ago we did the reparation on the port engine and uh, right now the port engine is in great condition, uh, it's ready to be aligned. Is uh, clean the engine room. They install additional gauge for uh, for uh, our meter temperature and oil pressure. They move it down the the water uh, strainer, the raw water strainer, uh, because the raw water strainer was located over the water line. This is no good. They they move it down to keep the the strainer uh, as close as possible to the to the uh, water line. And uh, the, the engine is clean, it's uh, in great condition, it's ready. We start the engine and um, we are going to calibrate the valves. Um, probably in other episodes I will show to you the procedure to calibrate the valves. Okay, and now in the starboard engine we are ready with the Jolly and Steve uh, to install. Uh, this is the, the rear uh, seal of the crankshaft. Uh, and uh, also we are going to replace uh, the front seal uh, of the crankshaft located over there. Uh, that one was the old one. You remove that one, no? Yes. Steve? Uh, easy? Pretty easy, yeah, yes. It's, yeah. it's not difficult. I no? just took a screwdriver and just yeah, behind. Correct. I, being careful not to damage. It's correct. No damage the housing, no? The right. housing is in great condition. Okay, great. And Jolly, you are ready to install the, the back one, no? Yes. Um, I installed that one in the hydraulic press. And uh, this is the grease original, no? The grease located mm -hmm. over there. Uh, guys, uh, be careful with the position because uh, that bracket should be located here. And uh, the the lips of the of the the lips of the seal should be facing inside of the engine because the oil enter over there and expand the lips. And uh, this is the front of the bracket. Okay, we are going to install the seal. Uh, you are ready with the bolts according with the specification of the manufacturer, no, Jolly? Yes, so what? the bolts are um, are marked as seven, which is typical for the EMR engine. Uh -huh. And then, oops, and then in the EMR manual, they'll tell you that the hex bolts with a seven, um, and then you have to figure out whether it's an M6 or an M8. So I use this um, bolt measuring Oh, and, perfect. And then I go like this, and it's an M8. Correct. So okay. therefore, this and what M, is the torque? The M8 will be 16.1 plus, plus or minus 4.4 pounds, foot pounds. Foot pounds. Foot pounds. So we're going to use 16, 16 as, a, as a good on end. the on the torque range. Right. But we don't set it up as 16. We're going to do a six. We're going to do. Slowly. Yeah. We're going to do 10 and then we'll go 12 and then we'll Correct. Do 16. The recommendation is you start with 20, uh, excuse me, with 10, 10, after that 12 and right. finally 16. Okay, great. Uh, this is uh, great. And uh, what about this one? Because it's a little dirt, uh, Steve. Right. I, I noticed I, you run your finger on it, you can feel it's rough. So I'm going to take like 800 or 1000 grit sandpaper. Correct. And how and you clean that? Well, you just do it. Nice and easy. And oh, nice it's and easy. Even. Okay, perfect. It's like, and so you're not don't you don't use your fingers because you could. Yeah, uh, correct. Get a indentation. Indentation. Thank you. That's correct. So you. Ah, uh, okay. You out. you clean that one, please. Okay. You prefer that area, and uh, the the surface was clean uh, previously. Yes, I uh, see. It's yes. clean, and you clean also with the um, with mineral spirit and uh, the bracket is clean and now we are ready to apply uh, the silicone and the and the grease uh, uh, steve what type of silicone you you use that one the, the silica or the ga liquid gaskets it's the yanmar rec the manufacturer uh, recommendation recommendation okay great which is yanmar and and uh, what about the grease oh Oh, lithium grease. Lithium grease. Lithium okay. grease. That's without a doubt. That's metal, metal on metal is lithium. Okay, perfect. Uh, if you see, guys, uh, the, the the seal is coming with a with a little grease over there. Uh, this is the original grease, uh, but uh, we are going to add it after uh, uh, Steve cleaned that area. We are going to add it a, a lithium grease over there. This is only to create a perfect seal in between the. Uh, seal and the and the crankshaft metal. 
Okay, we are going to prepare the conditions and uh, we are going to do the installation of uh, the rear seal in this uh, um, Janmar three cylinders engine. Okay, mineral spirit, always, always the manufacturer specification, follow the manufacturer specification. If you don't have the manual, don't try to do any type of reparation in a, in a diesel or gasoline engine. This is the most important part. Uh, follow the recommendation of the manufacturer. Clean, clean the, the surface, avoid grease. If not, you have leaks after that. Guiding, there's guide pins, so there's no way you can really kind of mess this up. <laughs> Correct. Be careful with the lips of the seal. Correct. Okay. Perfect. No, 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 no yet. At the end, clean, clean your finger here. Okay. Put the balls. Always, always use uh, the proper socket and uh, the ratch. Don't use uh, the electrical tools because uh, this is aluminum and you crack the bracket. The third wrench is prepared. Well, we gotta change it. We We're gonna put it to 10. We are going to start in 10. The way you use a torque is that you see the 10, so you see the 10, so you go up until you have the 0 on 10. Until the 0, no, but... Right there in the middle. So it's 10. No, but the, look, 10 is in the bottom, look. Go right. down, go down. Because this is, this is the, the, the end of 10 is this, you see? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, right that there's one. 10. All right. to apply the front seal of the crunch up that seal okay we are going to clean the housing now we are going to install the front seal
here. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay. Always, always protecting with the wood. Okay, that's perfect. That's great. Now we are going to insert the harmonic balancer with the, the middle bolt. We are going to uh, introduce, remove the harmonic balancer please. At the harmonic balancer we apply grease here, and grease over there. Now it's ready, please. Okay, and now with the piece of wood. More. More. Okay, that's okay. And now with the bolt we are going to Probably do, but nobody pays attention. That's okay, huh? Yeah. Yep. All right. Normally, that bolt should be tied with the impact uh, impact uh, tool, but uh, uh, I forget my impact tool today. Uh, we are going to lock the the flywheel with a flat screwdriver uh, in order to tighten that.